Hello, everybody, and welcome to your Vedic Lunar Scope for the 21st of April, 2018. Uh, the moon over the course of the day today will be transiting through Punarvasu Nakshatra. Uh, before we get into the moon's daily energy, I just wanted to remind everybody that, again, uh, starting next Sunday, the 29th of April, uh, for one class only, I will be doing a joint class with another astrologer uh, utilizing Vedic astrology and also the Cards of Truth system. Myself and Carmina Amsha will be doing a one-course webinar on foreign residency. There is a link up above in the video if you wish to go schedule a uh, slot for this particular webinar, which is at 4.30 p.m. London time on the 29th of April. You can learn how to uh, see if the potential for foreign residency is there for you. So when we know something, we generally feel a lot stronger, right? And when we feel strong like that, then, you know, we begin to feel, right, now I can really kind of commit myself to be dedicated to this next step that I need to take. It builds strength. It helps us to understand where we're going and what we're needing to do. And then we begin to feel more oomph. That's the word, oomph. <laughs> Even though it's not really a word, is it? Everybody understands that word, oomph. You begin to feel more oomph behind you. When you have that oomph behind you, you can act with strength and you can act with confidence. But if one part of you is still kind of holding on, you're not going to move very far forward, are you? Even though you know. And when you find yourself in that position of going, I know this is the way that I need to go, but still I'm holding on. What's the next thing that begins to happen to you? Well, <clears throat> pardon me, because you're holding on, you then find yourself in a position where you question. And then when you question, you begin to doubt what you know, or at least you think that you know. Did I really know that? I don't really know if I knew that. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I'm just convincing myself. Hmm. Maybe I you know, rather than committing myself, I need to be committed. Maybe it needs to be one of those things, and I don't really, ah, which step do I really take? It just becomes really uncertain for you, but it's becoming uncertain because you're holding on. And maybe you have some unfinished business. So give yourself a break, right? Maybe there's unfinished business. Maybe there are things that still need to be wrapped up. Maybe, just maybe, that's why you're not quite ready to take that next step, even though you do know. Or do you? Hmm. Prevarication is the hallmark of a lack of conviction and commitment. That only leads to greater uncertainty. So what am I not telling you today? I'm not telling you to convince yourself you need to take this next step, right? I'm not trying to tell you you need to dedicate yourself wholeheartedly to it. I'm not saying that because maybe there is some unfinished business you need to wrap up. But you need to begin to initiate the change. So what's the compromise? Small steps for now, small steps for now, and at least start the journey rather than staying stuck. Move forward a little bit at a time. While you're moving forward, wrap up your unfinished business. Take care of it all as you're proceeding and letting things shift. If you need a little bit of help with a difficult transformation, difficult decision, whatever it might be, I do offer several different levels of astrological service, which are available through the astrological services page of my website. If you'd like to schedule a slot in with me, you can do so through the link above in this video. That's going to do it for your Vedic Lunar Scope for the 21st of April 2018. Until next time, please do take the very best care of yourself. Bye now. 